Hey everybody, I'm Ryan Luke. Welcome back to another coin collecting video. This week we're doing coin of the month for February 2021, and we're going to be doing the Indian head head scent. So I'm gonna go get straight into it. So first we've got some statistics. Um, it's minted from 1859 to 1909, and there have been about 294 million 641,000 minted. So, not too many minted, and uh, the coin was designed by James B. Longacre, he was the chief engraver of the U.S. Mint at the time, and the coin was designed in 1858, and uh, it's made of 88% copper and 12% nickel. Uh, it was made at only San Francisco and Philadelphia, um, I'm not sure why it wasn't made at Denver, but it wasn't, according to my sources. Uh, it weighs about 4.67 grams, and its diameter is about 19.05 millimeters. So, now to the fun facts. So, next, so there are actually three different types of Indian head scent. So, if we go back up here, so all of these statistics, um, like the mintage is for the entire number for all of the Indian head scents, and same as this like individual stats, like what it's composed of, what, how much it weighed, and um, its diameter, those are, um, those are, um, those are individual stats, because it would be kind of compl complicated to do all three designs, so I decided to just stick with the, um, the first design. So, moving on, and uh, there isn't actually an Indian on the obverse, it is actually Lady Liberty wearing an Indian headdress. Um, I'll see more in the, uh, the next slide. Um, they, can be, they can be worth about between $1 and $10 today, and also uh, 1909 was actually the lowest mintage year, with only about 309,000 coins minted, so it's, very, it's not very much. And, uh, I said it was com sometimes called the nickel, or nick for short, short, uh, um, maybe g because it's made out of a little bit of nickel, I'm not sure, but, um, it was actually called nickel at the time, even though it was a scent. That's pretty interesting. So now I've got a closer look. So first is the obverse. Um, it features what looks like an Indian, but is actually Lady Liberty wearing an Indian headdress. Uh, as you might have, might know from the uh, fun facts slide, um, it also has the United States of America on it here, and then the date here. And um, next is the, uh, the the reverse. You can see it's got the words one cent in it, and it's surrounded by a laurel wreath. And um, if you actually look more closely at the coin, um, you can see that. It's actually missing a few key details that uh, that we see on pretty much all of all coins today. So you notice there's no e pluribus unum. Um, there isn't um, there isn't the uh, the inscription. Uh, the main the main um, basically saying of the coin. And um, so yeah. So next is the meme. The Indian head nickel, the Indian head scent. The Indian head nickel is a um, is a buffalo nickel. Um, <laughs> now for the resources: Indian head scent Wikipedia, Red Book of U.S. Coins, the Indian head scent, Coins dot the Fun Time and Sky dot Coin, com, facts about Indian head bays. So uh, thanks for watching, everybody. Uh, it's been a little short today, but. Nothing else to really say. Um, coin, coin of the month is always a little bit shorter than usual. And uh, if you have any questions, then please comment down below. I never really get any comments, so it'd be nice to kind of get one to respond to, to something. So thanks for watching, and if you're not subscribed, then please do. It's pretty free, and and uh, you don't have to. If you like the video, then please do. And I'll see you in the next video.